Guys, I'm doing this wee video because I know a lot of people's passwords have been reset and I know that some people don't know that you can actually, as a teacher, change any pupil's password in Go. So all teachers across Scotland have permission to change pupil passwords. So I'm on the launch pad just now and Glow have just logged into Glow and you'll notice a menu in the top left hand corner on the black bar. Selected on the launch pad screen just now, I can go to app library and find more apps and I can go to management console. Management console is where you want to change pupil passwords. So all you need to do is either find a group of users or an individual. So I'll show you both of those just now. You find groups on the left hand side under the heading users and groups. I click on groups. So for example, if I was teaching primary five, um, then I would go over here and I would click actions on the right hand side, change members passwords, and I could put in a temporary password for that whole class. So I could just put in, you know, password or something. That would do for the whole class just to get signed in quickly without any hassles. And if I leave this little box here checked, then the pupils can sign in with a temporary password, but then Glow will ask them to choose a new one of their own that's private uh, when they do that. So that's for a whole class. Um, again, under users and groups on the left-hand side, if I go to users this time, then I will find all the individual students. So if you just want to fit, change an individual's password, you go to users and then you can find them. Now you can search. So I could search for William, um, hit return, and then I see William Fraser. Go over to actions and change password. Again, if I want the password to be William's password forever, then I would uncheck this box. If I want him for security reasons, and privacy reasons to choose his own one again, then I would leave that box checked. So it's important to remember what that box does. Choose a password and then click save. That's it. It's dead easy. So management console and then you just need to find the people whose passwords you want to reset. One thing I have noticed is that Seamus hasn't updated um, all the groups yet for 2018-19 so they're still on the groups from last year, but these will be updated soon. So for the moment, probably the best thing to do is, well, pick last year's class or um, find pupils individually. Um, but that's it. It's really easy and any teacher can do that.